Hi everyone, welcome back to the Phoebe Way. On this channel, it's all about life in Germany, making it in Germany, and settling in Germany peacefully, smoothly, and easily. So today, I just thought, hmm, we are getting to the end of the year. We are about to form new habits. We're about to have new resolutions. And since we are in Germany, we should also adapt a bit. And things that I have observed as German habits that could actually help each and every one of us, I'm going to tell you in this video. So don't go anywhere. Don't click anywhere. Don't go anywhere. Don't, don't click away. I mean, <laughs> don't go anywhere. Don't click away. Stay tuned and enjoy this one. I've got seven German habits that are cool, that I find cool, and that I plan to implement or adopt in the year 2022. Okay, so let's get into it. Number one, learn to grow your own vegetables. Learn to grow your own produce. Learn to make your own food happen, okay? So lots of Germans, or oh, I've observed that Germans, even if they don't have a garden in front of their house, or they don't have their little flower pots and everything, they have something called Schreber Garten. So that's like a garden away from home. <laughs> At first I was like, ah. But in Ghana, some people also have like, they have their own farm. But that's the Schreber Garten in Germany. So that Schreber Garten, that Schreber Garten, Schreber Garten is a place where they usually hang out during summer, where they have some of their summer um, garden parties, yes, but they also plant and grow foods there. So people have um, their own, let's say, um, poultry or just different things that they like to do in terms of farming, okay? So farming, I'm going to start with little things. So this year in our family, we did um, raspberries, tomatoes, some herbs, so rosemary, marjoram, and different things, but I'm going to go bigger this year. So help me God. This year I'm going to go bigger and I'm going to show you guys if it works out. <laughs> but yes, grow your own vegetables and farm just do something in with 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 the, with the with the earth with the soil with dirt yes so do something with soil and grow your own produce that is the first habit that i plan on implementing number two is keeping cash and saving by that okay so paying by cash and, pay, and keeping cash and paying cash is something that is very jam not every place has um, takes cards. Okay, you think that everybody's getting digitalized and everything. Nope. You go to some shops that tell you you have to buy something from 10 euros upwards and maybe you just don't want to spend that much in that shop. So learn to keep cash when you go to certain shops. Learn to keep cash. Learn to keep cash and pay cash. And also they have German regular markets like the weekly markets where they also pay by cash as well. So cash is a German thing and it helps you to have an overview that's your like can keep your cash wallet as your budget for the week for your food and everything so that is one thing that is German that I've already adopted and I plan to continue as well one thing that is really German that I I find it hard to adapt but I want to is there is no bad weather in Germany they, they won't say the weather is bad so we're not going out it's either you are poorly dressed for the weather or you are well dressed for the weather so proper dressing is the key okay so you don't complain about the weather if it's raining you take your raincoat you take your umbrella you wear your boots your rain boots yes if the, it's cold you wear two pullovers you wear your thick jacket you wear your hat you wear your mittens or your gloves then you get out this is the German style so even though I'm going to run away, I'm going to be running away from the winter for a bit, I still will have to endure two, three months of winter. So I'm not going to complain about the cold. I'm just going to make sure I'm properly dressed so I don't get sick. And I'm going to head out because it is just a man thing. Don't complain about the weather. Fix yourself, okay? Fix yourself. Make sure that you are fine in that weather. So that's the German habit. If you're new in Germany, that's one thing you have to learn. Don't complain about the weather. Don't waste your time. Just fix yourself and align okay yes luggage pool luggage pool luggage pool as i told you the last time luggage pool is here to offer you solutions to your logistics problem and if you want to help luggage pool do that you should sign up as a driver if you have a legit a legit and valid driver's license in germany you should sign up if you have a car that has space and that we, of course it works for you to earn money on the side if you keep traveling or if you're always traveling do that so 
it doesn't have to always it doesn't always have to be a big car but if you have space in your luggage for example you can also um, sign up and also earn money on the side so that is the other side of luggage pool you're earning money and the other side is somebody find a solution to the logistic problem so if you're interested just check the link in the description box down below it is the very first link okay the very very first link check the link in the description box down below and sign up and upon your first transaction you get five euros off if that isn't good i don't know what else is so check our luggage pool and let me know how it went for you so sick leave when you're on sick leave you are sick okay you your phone your fax machine your email all of you together join sick that's it because when i was on sick leave it was until friday and my boss was like no we'll do everything after you you get well and even if you're still not well they will still have to wait because we're not going to risk you infecting the other people it was no corona by the way infecting me and the other people so if you're sick you're sick that's it you just call and say i'm sick what's the plan forward and that's it you are sick you are sick and nobody's going to bother you nobody bothered me till i got well and i reported back to work so if you're sick you're sick and that is something that i think is a good thing just take the time to take your mind off of work and get better and the same thing with when you're on holiday or on your vacation you're not supposed to be available every time you see me away from the office away from work i am really away i come back to the office and i check my email i don't take my email with me from the office to where i'm going no you don't do that so that is one german thing and so even though Germans work a lot and they are very efficient and effective, please, when it comes to taking a break, they mean business with taking the break as well. So that's one thing that I plan on continuing throughout the year 2022 and beyond. Okay, if I'm sick, I'm sick. If I'm busy, I'm busy. If I'm on vacation, I'm on vacation. Basta. Number, what, six, five? I don't, I can't, I don't even know anymore. Hmm. It's a bit of a touchy thing, but if you go into German households where there is a man and a woman, you realize that the toilet seat is clean and it doesn't stink. Okay, meaning that the mister sits on it as well while he pees. But when you go to other places, you realize that the men still insist on standing and peeing, please. With that one, let's let's just let's just be nice about it. Wherever you go, sit. Sit like manlich weiblich devils i don't care what gender what you are but sit sit down sit down and do your business okay sit it, it keeps your bathroom clean the place doesn't smell just sit <laughs> just sit yeah and then number five six as you have seen probably seen now i'm learning to be more direct okay just be frank no beating about the bush no, no, no. That's something I actually started in 2021. If you ask me, Phoebe, do you like this? If I like it, I'll say yes. If I don't like it, I'll say no. I'll not be like, hmm, for me, no, 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 no. You ask me, do you like it? And the answer is yes. The answer is no. I'm just going to be direct, okay? I'm fact direct. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, bam, bam. I like it. I don't like it. Basta. So I'm going to learn to be more direct and yeah. Thank you for watching guys i hope you enjoyed this one if you have any questions if you have any comments what you think is typically german that we should adopt or adapt to write in the description i mean in the comment section down below see you same time next sunday Ade, and of course yes merry christmas oh what's up merry christmas <laughs> merry christmas